Ryan, today's hearing centered around this controversial law that was signed last year. Now, this law, it bans buying, trading, and owning magazines over 10 rounds for rifles, over 15 rounds for handguns, these magazines they're talking about. A group of gun owners, retailers, and two state sportsmen's organizations filed a lawsuit back in April, and the plaintiff's attorney argued today that the magazine limit law goes against Vermont's Constitution, which they say, well, the Constitution guarantees the right to self-defense. Now, they also say the law is ineffective because they say it punishes law-abiding gun owners and won't deter someone from coming to Vermont to commit a mass shooting. But today, the defense maintains other states have similar reasonable restrictions, and Vermont's Constitution doesn't include freedom to choose which arms to bear. Now, the state argued today the governor and the legislature passed this law to keep citizens safe. And they did what they viewed was a reasonable step to protect the people of Vermont, uh, the children of Vermont, from uh, the epidemic of uh, gun violence that exists in this country. All a mass murderer has to do is drive across the border to New Hampshire and buy a made in Vermont manufactured magazine and drive it back and commit mayhem. And now, the judge didn't issue a decision today. It's unclear when we'll hear whether this will move forward or whether she'll dismiss the case. We're live in Montpelier. Renee Wonderlich, NBC5 News.